PlantNet is an application that allows you to identify plants from photos. It can be downloaded from the App Store or Google Play on your mobile or accessed via the web. To access PlantNet via the web, click on the dedicated button. Before joining the Locust Biotopes microproject, it is important to create an account. By creating an account you will be able to track your data and join or create groups. You'll be able to share your data with the community and contribute to research projects such as the one monitoring the development of the Desert Locust. The menu on the main page allows you to access PlantNet by geographical area or by specific theme. Click on the Locust Biotope microproject. You are now inside the microproject, which means that your observations and research will take place in the project's specific flora. From this page you can make identification requests, explore project data, and view contributions from other users. To make an identification request, go to the Identify tab and drag your photo into the Add window. The application asks you to specify which part of the plant it is. The application is much more powerful if you add several photos for the same plant and if you illustrate several organs, flowers, leaves, fruit, bark. You can upload up to four photos for a single observation. Make sure your photos are of good quality, i.e. well framed, clear and without object or character in the frame. The quality of the identification result depends to a very large extent on the quality of the images submitted. Once your images are loaded, click on Identify in the Locust Biotope Flora. The results appear in the form of a list of plants ranked in order of certainty. You can enlarge the images illustrating each species by clicking on them. Clicking on the species name takes you to a page containing information on the species such as its distribution, phenology or the altitudes at which it grows. You can also explore all the images shared by other PlantNet users, as well as species description web lenses. Go back to your observation. Confirm your choice of identification by clicking on, this is the right species. And don't hesitate to vote even if you're not sure. Other, more qualified users will be able to review your identification. Then share your observation with the community. Your data will help improve our knowledge of the species that support the development of the desert locust. They will be integrated into scientific research projects on this theme and you'll become an actor of participatory science. You can explore the project data by clicking on the dedicated tab. You will find all the plant species in the locust biotope flora. Exploration can be done by family, by genus or by species. You can refine your search by clicking on Option. This gives you the option of filtering by IUCN red list or by usage, and gives you access to various sorting modes. You can search for a species by entering its name in the search box. The Contribution tab lets you explore all the observations shared in the Desert Locust Biotopes flora. By clicking on Observation Details, you can vote for species name if you agree with identification, report misidentification by clicking on undetermined species or vote for image quality. Identify plants and become an actor of citizen science.